Winology. How to make your wine. Remove everything from your Winology box and place it aside. Check to ensure you have all the necessary components. You'll need it for fermenting and serving your wine. Fold in all four box flaps. Punch out the perforated hole at the bottom of the box for the dispensing spout and fold out the top tab outwards. Remove the tamper seal from the fermentation bag and snap the spout into place with your thumbs. Lock the spout into place and push the perforated tab in to secure it. Unscrew the cap from the fermentation bag and remove the tamper seal. Pull the bag apart to make room for the water and juice blend. Fold the flaps down on your cardboard insert and push the insert into the box. Make sure the spout is pulled through and locked into place. Pour 2.54 liters of room temperature water into the bag. That's 10 and 3 quarter cups. Add the bentonite. Screw on the cap and shake for one minute. Add the juice blend slowly and then add the yeast. Screw on the cap and shake for 30 seconds. Unscrew the orange cap and place loosely on the spout. This will prevent gas buildup during fermentation. Wait for 11 days. Set a reminder on your phone. After 11 days, add the sodium metabisulfite and potassium sorbate. Screw on the cap and shake for 30 seconds. When you notice pressure, loosen cap to let the gas escape. Repeat this process five times to remove CO2 from your wine. The more you shake it, the better your wine will be. Add the Kieselsol and shake for 30 seconds. Loosen the cap to let gas escape and wait five minutes. Add the Kytazan and shake for 30 seconds. Loosen the cap to let the gas escape. Let the wine sit undisturbed for five days. Set another reminder on your phone. After five days, carefully remove the cardboard insert and separate the bag in the box to dislodge any sediment. Reinstall the cardboard insert and lock the fermentation bag into place. Let stand undisturbed for five days. Remove the orange cap and dispense the first 100 milliliters of wine. Throw it away. It's full of sediment. If the wine is still cloudy, continue to let the wine out in 50 to 100 milliliter increments until it runs clear. Remove the spout completely from the wine serving bag. Transfer the wine from the fermentation bag using the opening you just made. Do not tilt the box. Minimal movement is essential. Carefully remove as much excess air as possible. This will help your wine stay fresh longer. Snap the spout back into place. You should hear three snaps. Unlock the fermentation bag from the cardboard insert. Remove both, clean, and recycle. Carefully transfer the full wine serving bag into the box. Lock the spout into place. Close the box flaps. Congratulations! You're now ready to serve and enjoy your delicious wine. Winology. Defy tradition. Your wine, your way.